Bob Foundation, do you want to see what it's like to be part of one of the biggest rivalries in college sports? It's game day. Ben's Ice Hockey, Quinnipiac versus Yale. I'll show you why this is one of the most anticipated days of the year at this Quinnipiac Day in the Life. Good morning, Bobcats. My name is Kelsey Killian. I am a senior biology major, and I also have chemistry and psych minors. I'm also the president of QU Spirit, which is a student organization focused on school spirit. We do a lot of stuff with the hockey teams. We have a really big day ahead of us today. Today is the men's ice hockey versus Yale game. It's our rivalry game. For the game today, I'm most looking forward to just being in the atmosphere. The Yale game is always a great time. We get the biggest crowd. It's insane. It's really loud and the game's always good. Beat Yale, we always win. So before the game tonight, we actually have a big day ahead of us. I'm starting my day at 7 a.m., 12 hours before puck drop, and I am going to my experiential learning experience. And after that, I have class, and then immediately after that, I'm gonna go back to York Hill for the hockey game. I'm now at my experiential learning experience. I am a medical assistant at a dermatology office. For this experience, I get to shout out Lindita Vinca, APRN, who has just over 10 years of dermatological experience. And I'm really excited for this experience because not only do I get to learn more about dermatology, but I get to learn more about leadership as someone in the medical field. And I get to learn more about how the medical field works in general. Today, I only saw eight patients, which is a little less than usual. And really, I just learned more about different um, dermatological conditions that you can get. Four hours until puck drop. I am just getting to main campus where I'll be going to class for evolution. Today in evolution we covered the importance of biodiversity and the mechanisms of evolution which are natural selection, genetic drift, mutations, and migration. So I'm gonna head over to the arena now. T minus two hours until puck drop. I am so excited. So I'm officially at the arena. It is an hour and a half until puck drop. The Teletubby tradition started about 10 years ago. Basically how this started was a couple of college guys decided one Halloween to dress up as Teletubbies at a hockey game. We won the game and since then they decided to just keep wearing it for the rest of the season and we kept winning games. So now 10 years later we wear this every game as a good luck charm. Today has been really fun, really great, really tiring. Quinnipiac won versus Yale for nothing, which is always great. We love a shutout. Balancing QU spirit with my academics and my other extracurriculars has been hard throughout different times of my experience at Quinnipiac, just because my course load has changed throughout my time here. But now as a senior, it's a lot easier. I'm not in class as much, and a lot of my classes have to do with experiences outside of the classroom. So it's actually pretty easy to balance everything just as long as I plan everything out, I keep up with my plan, and everything just goes smoothly. Overall, my entire experience at Quinnipiac has been really awesome, and I'm really excited to graduate and say that I got to spend four amazing years here at Quinnipiac. Be sure to check out other Quinnipiac Day in the Life videos to check out Quinnipiac all for yourself. Go Bobcats!